Good morning all, early on a Sunday morning. Um, very few things you can guarantee in the orchid world. Um, a trip to Mary's Meadows around this time, um, a field full of fantastic green winged orchids is probably an exception to that rule. At least I thought it was. Uh, I came here, what, um, 10 days ago. Uh, normally the field would be awash with fantastic uh, green winged orchids and it wasn't. Uh, small in number, small in stature, mostly still in bud. Um, they were running at least 10 days late, so it was disappointing, uh, demoralizing even. As I say, you can guarantee a good show here and it just wasn't here. So I've come back 10 days later, that's today. Um, I know the show won't be anything like previous seasons, but at least those that were in bud should now be out of bud and in flower. We've had pretty much 10 days of rain uh, and much more mild temperatures, although it's quite chilly this morning. Uh, no more frosts, so mild, wet. They should have enjoyed that. And yeah, I'm hopeful it'll look at darn sight better than it did 10 days ago. So, fingers crossed. bit damp this one but it's a nice pink just looks like it's been in some heavy rain which it has quite an amazing transition from 10 days ago these uh these plants were struggling back then but the uh the wetter weather we've had has undoubtedly given them a burst of uh energy and they're uh, two to three times bigger as a result Good to see. That's a nice one. It's a nice uh, little white one, very dainty, but pure white, variety alba, without a doubt. I was a bit concerned 10 days ago that the numbers were well down, but they've really, really recovered. Even if they have been soaked, there's certainly uh, numbers can 
comparable with previous seasons. Good to see. Some nice markings on that one. That's a nice flower. It's actually two together, but gives the impression of a very nice flower. They say these uh, variety Alba make up 0.1% uh, of the population of green winged orchid. That's one in a thousand by my mathematics. Uh, we've seen about four of them in this field so far, so it's quite a good turnout. That's another genuine Alba there. It's uh, an unusual, a very pretty sort of whitey pinky, don't know how you'd describe it. Certainly different to everything that's around it. That's a very nice flower. I do like that one. Very few pinks in the field this year. This is probably one of the better ones that I've seen. There's only been about four or five. Well, that's it. Um, yeah, you know, what, did, what didn't we see? Uh, we didn't see a standout absolute clonker of a plant. There's always one or two here that are just awesome and we didn't see any. Uh, saw more whites than we normally see. Saw fewer pinks than we normally see here. But I'll tell you what, brilliant. Really, really, really good. I mean, I was here 10 days ago, as I say, and the place was decimated. Uh, the numbers looked way down. It looked pretty miserable and, and to recover to that degree in 10 days is fantastic and a relief uh, and I think it just shows it wasn't so much they were decimated by any sort of damage it's just the season was two weeks at least two weeks behind there's still some in bud now um, which is crazy but yeah it's good to see it back uh, I think I'm gonna head along the road five minutes to another site that we went to this time last year, well actually it was two weeks ago last year, the Dawson had a few green winged orchids, not so many, uh, but I'd love to see a one-off spectacular pink or something of that nature that we didn't see here, so yeah I'm going to jump in the car and take a five minute detour and see if there's anything turning up at that site. Welcome back to Cribs Meadow. We were here last year. Um, it's supposed to be a field full of green winged orchids, but it isn't. Uh, it's a small population crammed into one corner of the field, which makes it easy to find them. 
um, and they're generally just purple but I was here 10 days ago just checking the place out and it was a pink uh, it was in bud but it was a pink and I'm going to come back and see how it's fared over the last 10 days hopefully it will be in a glorious full flower now let's go and take a look There's never a shortage of orchids at uh, Cribs Meadow. Uh, they tend to be pretty much the same and they're very much concentrated in this one corner of the field. But they always put on a good show. Looking very good. There's a little pink one, still mostly in bud though, amazingly for middle of May. Well there she is, fully grown, about six inches tall now. A lovely soft pink. Just approaching the exit and I've probably found the best green winged orchid I've seen today. I think the orchid of the day is probably going to be the last one. Uh, a lovely pink. Very nice.